right, so I'm going to show you how I did that uh, with the Equinox uh, projecting this flat map um, onto the globe. Uh, so first I just did right click, save image. Uh, for that time. So I went, uh, so 12, that's 12 o'clock at night. <clears throat> so basically I went from 2 o'clock and you'll notice it stays the same because it's the equinox and then it just slides all you know over um, so we'll go 6, six o'clock Really, I did it to 11, so there's a way, so I should have, <clears throat> you ain't going to notice one hour the way I did it, but because um, I did had a counter on it, um, so anyways, I right clicked that, saved the image. And so that's what this is. Same, same thing. So, is what I do is I place that in here, fit the screen, and I'll go T for the opacity. And you'll notice that I got the, uh, the night map and the day map in here and it fits exactly on top of each other okay so is what I do is I <clears throat> draw a mask around the edge of the uh, the opacity um, and then I just kind of slid that over so that's at two o'clock once it catches up right there and then to uh actually that's 12 o'clock but i on mine i got 11 so one hour ain't gonna matter um and i'm right here in kansas so Probably right there. Wow. So when you do that, then it it basically does this. And so then I took. Um, so the reason why you don't, I have them both spinning. So that's the thing. Uh, so I do have a rotation on here. C, 95, it's rotating. But you notice the, uh, the Terminator line is staying in one spot. So that means I haven't synced right. Uh, so this is what I did, I took 10, 10 hours uh, basically, I did nine hours, so two uh, two o'clock to uh, eleven. Close enough. But uh, so I took ten hours times fifteen, or fifteen times ten, um, which got me to one fifty. I I rotated one hundred fifty degrees, so that's why I have one fifty right there, and that's Hawaii. So, it's pretty neat. I don't like right there, it's probably like you know, 7.30, so I put it counter on there and 
it works. It's pretty cool.